welcome to Modi Makes. What's good everybody? My name is Modi, this is Modi Makes, and today we're gonna be getting back to doing a canvas painting. I know it's been a couple weeks since I've actually done a canvas, so getting back to my roots a little bit right there. <laughs> but this one is going to be a little bit different than ones I've done in the past. It's still gonna be in my blue mini style, but it's going to be a little more deconstructed, I guess, a little more abstracted than even that. So this piece is entitled Watchdog. And the Watchdog is a creature who's incredibly skeptical and paranoid because he loves what he guards so dearly um, that he is always terrified of losing it and therefore will not open up to anything new and will essentially kind of destroy the things that he sees as a threat to that thing that he loves so dearly. Now, um, I mentioned it's going to be a little bit different, a little bit more abstracted. I'm going to be using these three red bars that I put through it, which is not a general thing for my backgrounds. I generally use smoother gradients and uh, maybe bright circles and stuff like that, but I'm using these three red bars as kind of contour lines to stop and start different areas of color and different line work elements just to abstract it a little bit more and make it just a, a little bit more visually interesting. So let's get into it, shall we? I'm 
Well, there you have it, my peoples. The watchdog is complete. And you know, I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. Um, it's pretty out there compared to my normal stuff. I mean, it's not super different, but it is super different in certain ways, like I said before. And just nice to know that I have that kind of diversity in my pocket if I need it, because, uh, yeah, you know, it, it can get kind of tiring making the same thing over and over again. But let me know what you guys think of the piece down in the comments below. Let me know what you guys think about the style change of this compared to my normal stuff. Um, and uh, if you have any questions or any ideas for things to do in the future or, you know, any comments in general, throw those down there as well. I'd be happy to look at them and respond to every single one like I always do. And, you know, if you liked the video, go ahead and give me a like. That would be fantastic. And if you like me and you like the channel and you want to help support me, then the number one thing that you can do is to subscribe. I really couldn't thank you enough if you did. It means the world to me. And with all that out of the way, without further ado, let's get in those final shots, shall we? Thanks for watching.